hello this is butterfly budgets and on this channel we do some cash stuffing some savings challenges budget planning and a lot of running my mouth because your girl likes to talk if you want to see what i got going on and how i manage a low income budget go ahead and stay tuned okay guys so today we're going to be going over our um budget for the next two weeks so i do have my budget tracker i will be working in the budget mom um workbook i've been working in this last year but i have a few pages left that um you know i can fill. i don't use the calendar on here i got this calendar that i um that i got from dollar tree and i write down all my stuff in here um so yeah but i do use the paycheck budget tracker i love the paycheck budget tracker so i'm gonna use this for another year because next year I am looking forward to getting um um tailor budgets and um oh my gosh I cannot think what is her I know her name and that's I just I just looked at her video so that I'll put her name right here um Brittany her name is Brittany but I'll put her <laughs> the name of her um budgeting channel right here but uh, I'm gonna get their book for next year so. Um, this budget, this, um, we're going to be working with $500 for, um, our next cash stuffing. The next cash stuffing, um, uh, video will be up on Saturday. Um, and I will try to get this out today. It's Thursday. So I'll try to get this out. If not today, I'll try to get it out Friday. Um, but I'll try my best to get it out Thursday. So if I, if you see it out and it's on Thursday, woohoo, I did it. <laughs> um, we're not going to look at my nail. It's actually, I think it fell. I had the nail and I was going to glue it back, but you know what? Forget it. It is what it is. And we just going to work with what we got. All right, so we're working with five hundred dollars. Um, this is not from my paycheck. This is from my account. I'm trying not to touch anything with that. Um, because I am. I'm also expecting um two refund checks. Um, at my old apartment, I had got a refund from the um the Wi-Fi we were under. I got a refund check from that, and I also got from my loan that I had. I paid over, and I ended up getting a refund check from that. So. Um, I'll work in that and all that money is actually going to go towards my uh, sinking funds and my saving challenges. So as you probably can see, I'm not stuffing as many sinking funds this um go round, um, this paycheck or this go round because I know I'm waiting on that extra money to come in. And that's when I'll do that. Um, so, um, cash stuffing for that. So of course the phone dance to um, my, my daughter's dance tuition, um, life insurance, car insurance, Apple car, and gas is going to be the same because, of course, I pay half of those bills. And if you're new here, I don't have that many bills. I live with family right now because we're trying to save up for a home so we can move out. Um, So I really barely have any bills, which is, thank God, and that's a blessing. Um, So, yeah, so I'm going to, my phone Um, for this half, which is due, I'll pay all my bills on my credit card so I can get my points and then I always pay my credit card at the end of the month all my bills go into here and then at the end of the month when it's time for me to pay my bills I put all that money back into my account and I pay my um cards off um so my dad's tuition my daughter's dad's tuition um second half is $43 my life insurance this will be the um this will be the second half that's crazy this will be the second half because I just came out. But like I said, um, all these will be the second half. I think that'll be the first half of that one. Um, and that's the only one that comes out with the first paycheck. All these come in after the paycheck, but I don't worry about it until the end of the month. Car insurance. I pay $50 for my car insurance because I have my mother-in-law's um, old car. And she just asked for $50 a month. That's a blessing in itself. And that's I'm not arguing with that. So I split it in half. So for this paycheck, I'm doing $25. And all the other is $50. Apple Card, um, my subscriptions come out of my Apple Card because I do get um, 2% and 3% back from that uh, on my Apple Card. I love the Apple Card, so that's one of the cards. I use two cards for my bills um, and my gas, and then I use my Apple Card for my like subscriptions or whatever like that. So that's $20 that's going there. And um, for my gas, um, I do $40, and I pay with my credit card, and that just goes into my... Um, that goes on my what bill? Do, 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 do. That goes in this car reports credit card. This setup is gonna be it's gonna change within the next few months, but for right now, not my according because I love that, but 
some stuff is gonna change um but for now it works it works it works for now so yeah that's what that photo does gas has been actually kind of low where i'm where i am i'm in georgia and my gas has actually been low so i haven't actually been spending the whole 40 so actually i had a lot of rollover with that um so the bill total is 173 that's always 173 so i always know that i'm putting at least 173 within my bills until you know i get more bills and that changes which will be soon happening um because like i said my health insurance um the stuff that's going to be going on with my i'm be getting on newer health insurance and um i don't know if this is putting my business out there but i am on medicaid um of course but this was before i got married <clears throat> But when I get cut off of that, I know either um, we're going to get new insurance or I know for a fact I'm going to have to pay for vision because that is what it is. That's a whole other subject. And when we get that, when we get to that road, then I'll talk about it more. But for right now, I'm paying one seventy three. Leftover is three twenty seven. Um, If you didn't look at my last video, I am not cash stuff. Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. I am not cash stuffing my envelope at the moment. Let me push this up so y'all can see let me kind of move um i am not cash stuffing my um wallet at the moment the wallet i have is the moterm and i was cash stuffing this wallet but i get a i was using my card for this month my um my newer credit card for this month because you get uh when you you get a sign up bonus after you spend a thousand dollars um on your credit card and that can be with anything it can be with purchases that can be with bills that can be with anything shopping regardless um you get a 200 dollar bonus so i'm almost close to that bonus so <clears throat> instead of me putting my the money in my it may make sense to some and it may make sense to uh, not make sense to others but this is gonna this, look i i got it all right um I knew how much I had to go until I got it. So that's why I split my spending. So this is how much I think or less than that I have to go to spend on the card. I may or may not, may not spend all my spending because the goal is to not spend as much. <laughs> but um, I know I'm almost there to get that bonus because I do want that bonus. That's $200 that I can put towards my singing funds. So um, I left that in my account and I'll just be spending on my card until I get my bonus. Uh, once I get my bonus, so in February, I will start back um, cash stuffing in my wallets. I will start back, you know, doing my categories in my wallet. Um, so that's 150 that's going in there, and that's going to be my spending for the rest of the two weeks. I do not spend money like that. I don't go out really anywhere. I don't do anything. Only because with my job right now, it's not really a secure job, and I'm, try I'm in the process of trying to find another job. Um, because, yeah, it's not it. <laughs> so it's is not it um which is why i'm getting money from my bank account instead of my paycheck because there's a lot going on right now so i am actually in the search of a new job um so leftover is 177 so the funds that are getting um stuff um uh, for friday's paycheck is emergency fund vision locks i have to get a lock retwist because i just got locks and i'm doing my first retwist in february um so i do have to bulk that up but it's um locks pet care um I actually have to take out a pet care because I just bought. We have a guinea pig and I just bought stuff for him. So I have to take that money out. Um, dance stuff. She has a competition. My daughter has a competition coming up in March. So we do have to put that towards that. We have to start stuffing that a little bit more in February. And um, my daughter, the money that I stuff in her sinking fund, that goes to her um, savings account. We have a high yield savings account for her and she gains interest. So when that gets to a certain amount, I take that out and I put it into her account. Um, I do a new changes that's going on just so, since I'm here. I have a binder coming for her. So I'm going to have a binder just for her. It's going to say it's going to be pink and it's going to have butterflies on it. And it's going to say Zayna. Um, and it's going to have like clothes, shoes, back to school and it's fun. And that's going to be her and I'm going to be stuffing that. Um, because of course y'all know it's refund season. So when those refunds come in, we're going to be stuffing more and we're going to, y'all going to see more people with more money and um, stuffing their tax refunds. So that's why I got her own thing. So if I need something for her, I could just come out of her, you know, her binder instead of going into her, um, savings. Um, and then my MasterCard, I'm paying down debt, only have one debt at the moment. Um, I'm paying down debt on this 
MasterCard. Um, so I'm putting twenty. I put twenty five every two weeks, so that's fifty dollars. Plus, the only bill that comes out of this card is my phone because I do get points with that card as well. So I pay my phone bill with that card. Um, that's been going on for a year that I've been paying on that card for like that. So I just kept it like that so it can still see that it is um being used. So I do my phone bill on that card and then I, you know, put the money. I pay it off with the money from the phone bill and the extra $50 so I can start paying that down. And I am... So what I'm starting to do is actually going through my savings challenges and be like, okay, how much can I put towards these savings challenges? So I have $124, $124 left. Um, um, for my 1,000 savings challenge, I'm putting 50. For my scratch off savings, I had an IOU. We ain't going to talk about it. We ain't going to talk. Just go back and look at the video, child. We ain't going to talk about it. That savings challenge was very interesting. But I, I owe you a $25, but I ain't doing nothing else for that scratch. I'm not doing that scratch off um this week because i have an iou so i'm gonna just take care of that iou heads and tails i'm doing 25 dollars and i'm just gonna do ones and i'm just gonna let it do what it do if i have left over then i'll figure out where it's going and then i have a 200 dollars saving challenge um and it's going to 16 dollars is going towards that 200 dollars saving challenge so my savings total my saving challenge total is 116 dollars i had the um i know you can see right here i had eight dollars left over that eight dollars went to her because that wasn't she wasn't down there at first but I was like, okay, well, since I got $8 left over, I'm going to go ahead and give it to her. So, I'm trying to move quick because uh, I got to get back to um, doing some schoolwork and some assignments. So, um, I'm trying to move really, really quick right now. My daughter, ha my daughter had an awards ceremony today. Um, it's their 100 day of school as well. And they had a um, ceremony and she got the top reader um i ready reader she was the top one in her class she had a honor roll um and she had perfect attendance um for quarter two so i'm so excited i'm like so proud of her because i knew she can do it she always gets discouraged she's only in first grade but she gets so discouraged but um so yeah and this is where the breakdown happens of how we take out the cash flow. and a lot of people wonder like how do we get our denominations this is how we break it down so phone is getting 21 so it's getting a 20 and a one um and so on and so on and for the heads and tails i'm getting 25 ones so i just put 25 ones i got a lot of ones i got 40 ones it all works out all of it came to 350 i did not count the money that um i would usually take out for my cash envelopes i'm leaving that in the bank so this is the money that i will be stuffing um so yeah um let me go ahead and put this to the side i did want to show you so i have a new a5 binder um for my high priority so this is the um high priority binder that i am using right now um ooh. i'm getting new stickers for, don't worry y'all they're coming i'm gonna do some happy mail um some happy mails later on like next week because i think my stuff is starting to come in some of the stuff got shipped off already so i'm getting new um vinyl stickers for these <laughs> so don't talk about me um don't talk about me i put the one month ahead right here because i didn't want to do it as a challenge because yes it is a challenge but i want to go ahead and put it in my high priority um i do i think i have a one month sticker coming and i'm going to put it on one of my um purple envelopes and then i'll just leave this in here um because the one month ahead i have two one month ahead one month ahead is for when we move and we get our home I want to be one month ahead there and then I need one month ahead for my bills now so I can be ahead of the bills that I have going on now. So this is why this is in here, but this one is going to my high priority. And I'm going to have, and then I'm going to, when I get the purple envelope, when I put this in the purple envelope, I'm going to have this one and I'm going to probably put this in, hmm, I'm trying to think. I'm probably going to put it in my low priority for the time being. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. Um, and then I have the car maintenance, medical, um, vision, our home, household. Household is going to be, of course, like I said, for when we move, when I start back my cash envelopes in February, um, any, um, leftover money. So any rollover money will go right in here. So I can have that for my household. So when we move any cleaning products or any stuff that we have to get, like soap, body care that we have to get. I will already have rollover money that'll be in here. <laughs> Student loans and taxes. I'm moving all of these into my new one. Oh, isn't it so pretty? 
Oh, I love, uh, this is, uh, I'm going to um, put this in the description. I got this off of Amazon. It is so pretty. It's just the outside that's like uh, sparkly, but I have vinyl, it's sparkly black. It's like glittery black. And I was like, ooh, I can switch it out. And this is going to be turned into my three to six month um, binder. So all of my bills, when we move, all of my three to six months bills is going to be in here. Um, like I said, throughout the year, I'll explain more with that. But since I'm here, I'm going to speed this up right quick. And I'm just going to put these in this. Um, go ahead and start putting these in this envelope. Okay, so really quickly, since I'm here, and then I'm going to put this down here until I start filling out my three to six months expenses. Um, so that won't be until like um the middle of this year, so like fall. Um, so while we're here, I'm going to go ahead and talk about my goals for this year or my money goals for this year. Um, oh, oh, girl. Okay, so basically, of course, my goals for this year is to get a new job. I can't really get into my goals that much until I get more income coming in. So that is my main goal really right now is to get a better paying job until I finish school. Because once I finish school, I know for a fact I'm going to be fine and I'm going to be secure. But for this year, I'm trying to get out of the place I am now and find more security and more a more beneficial job for my family until I finish school so um yeah so I just want right now I just need prayers um I just need encouragement that that's gonna happen um because I'm trying not to stress about my you know finances right now because it has been very crazy this month it's been very it may not seem like it but and I've been dealing with it I've been trying to you know manage but it's been, you know, up in the air. But yeah, um, y'all just send encouragement in the comments, and um, yeah. But all right, I'm gonna go ahead and go. Um, thank you guys for watching this video. Um, go ahead and remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, all everything that I talked about in this video, I will link down in the description box, and I will see y'all guys in the next video. Bye.